Hey guys, welcome to another video. So today we will be telling you about what is an Erasmus scholarship, how do you apply for it, and how can you benefit from this. So let's get into it. So what is an Erasmus program? Erasmus is an international student exchange program that is very popular in the EU and they even have some countries participating outside the EU as well. So what is the benefit of doing this? If you are a student who is eligible for Erasmus, you get to go to another European country and study there for one semester with a scholarship for every month for your living expenses in that particular country. So depending on the country that you are going to apply for and depending on the living standards of that particular country, the stipend amount that you get every month will also increase. And now you must be wondering what are the requirements that you must meet in order to apply for this program. So let's get into that next. So what are the requirements? In order to apply for an Erasmus program, you are required to have a minimum grade of seven on all your subjects. I mean, it depends on your university, but most probably it's seven. In some universities to apply for Erasmus, six is even fine. So in order to apply for Erasmus, there's always a deadline and all the information is usually given on your online studies portal. So different universities have different portals. So just check your portals and make sure that you can see the deadlines, you can see the requirements. And every university usually always has an Erasmus coordinator. So this person will be in charge of helping you with all the application process, giving you all the right information and telling you which university and which country actually matches your course profile and your semester so get in touch with them for more information so you must be wondering how long can you do this Erasmus program so usually you get it for one semester but you are actually able to extend it for another semester but then you might have some problems with the credits matching up with your home university and the foreign university so if there is some problems with some subjects not being transferable then you might have to do an extra semester with one or two subjects when you come back to your home university so keep this in mind if you plan on on extending your Erasmus scholarship. Another option I would definitely say is that you could completely transfer your studies from your home university to your Erasmus university, but then you would have to start paying the tuition fee for your Erasmus university. So for example, if you're a student from Latvia who is doing Erasmus in Denmark, for example, and you want to transfer studies to Denmark, then of course the tuition fee is going to be a lot more than what you used to pay in Latvia. So if that is not an issue, you can always transfer your studies because every subject has an ECTS point or European credit transfer system point and all these subjects with these points are intertransferable between uh, universities in Europe. It just depends if the program that you are taking in another university has the same subject. If so, it's definitely transferable and you do not have to redo these subjects again. So as part of the admission process in order to be granted this Erasmus scholarship, you're also required to write a small but very simple English exam. So in order to apply for Erasmus, uh, if you're a bachelor student, your first year must be completed. And if you're a master's student, your first semester must be completed. And as I said before, every subject you should have seven or six. It depends on the university and the requirements, but most probably it's around these numbers. So every subject you should have six or seven as your pass grade. So I hope this video was very useful for you and you got some more information about Erasmus opportunities. Uh, and if you have any questions, please put it in our comment section or DM us on Instagram. We are active there. See you guys in another video very soon. So take care and bye-bye.